and becoming the best at it and mastering myself and seeing what I have within me. If you decide to drop your buckets where you are and develop your gifts, I grant you, you will never ever be without. I grant you that your gifts will take you places that will literally amaze you. up guys um so good morning good afternoon um we are actually going to be heading to go pick up Aaliyah's birth certificate so yeah so we're gonna go do that and we have a couple small things that we have planned today so this might not really be a car type of vlog it's just going to be a day kind of vlog so let's start heading to what's happening on serious the place to go get my baby's birth certificate Hey, what is up guys? Um, so we're at my sister's house and she's doing something right now, but right now I am going to be deep cleaning the car the best I can. So I got most of this done. Um, I am waxing it a little bit and I'm using turtle wax. That's what I'm using right now. So, I mean, the car's coming out a lot cleaner. I mean, it looks really, really nice. Out here looking like a mirror and shit. Hey. But yeah, I'm just going to be doing this right now. And just cleaning up the car, like deep clean it. Because I think we are going to be heading downtown to get some pictures of the car. And I want it to look beautiful. <laughs> so I'm just gonna deep clean the car and then I'll show you I'll show you guys how it comes out and I'll see you guys after so. just to show you guys the difference you can't tell how white that is and then after waxing it looks so much better oh yeah the car's almost done I am actually just on the back bumper and then the whole car is gonna be all clean it looks like a mirror right now um but let's get this done yo guys so we were looking for places to take pictures of or take pictures at and we came across this pyramid thing which i've never seen before in my life and that shit looks fucking dope i wish i could park my car next to it and get a pic sick yo today's a new day guys and we're gonna actually gonna be starting on the car so we are going to start wrapping this in the same material as my shift knob so let's take this off so yo um we're gonna start by removing this panel um i did take this uh this off um whatever the fuck this is called um there's just a little pin you gotta pick up and then take off and then there's just screws in here and then it's a phillips screwdriver roll down the window so this is the clip that I was talking about just small goes in between here I want to get a flathead and pop this stuff around. Here. 
gonna have to take off. Yo, so I got it off, and let me show you. So I got spray and bond. This is what I'm going to be using. Um, it's just adhesive you spray on, and it should go over. So this should work good. Um, I'm actually going to need um, an iron for this, so I'm going to have to go grab an iron from inside the house, and then. Here is the fabric. So I got the iron and I'm just gonna start it off. So Preheated to high, so uh, sit that, let's let that sit for a little bit, and then I'm going to start tucking it in in a sec. Yo, guys, so I got most of it done. I just cut it out a little bit bigger and just sprayed it. And right now, I'm just going along the side that I already sprayed and just tucking it in. There is some bubbles or like scrunch up parts that I messed up. sorry I got the hiccups um, that I messed up on like right here and right here but so far so good now I gotta work on the top but like I said I'm I'm just using my ID or my driver's license and just sticking it in there so I'm gonna switch this around but I'm gonna go around and tuck these in and I'll see you guys in a sec okay um, so I'll show you guys how I do it. I'll just do. A, I'm doing a little bit at a time, so I'm gonna want to spray. So I'll just do the smaller part first. You gotta make sure you stretch the fuck out of it. Get your iron, and you wanna do it firm. It says go in a circle, but obviously I'm going back and forth because I cannot go in a circle. And it says to do it for about 30 to 45 seconds, as firm as you can, so I feel like that's okay. And what I'm going to do now is, see right here, I'm going to cut some of that extra off of this. And I am tucking it in there the best I can. There's going to be a lot of extra, so I'm just planning on tucking it in there the best I can and I'm just going to go on the other side and take that um, I would use the old card I'm using my old ID so it doesn't really matter if it's all bent and shit bent and shit <laughs> I got everything put back together. Thank God, fucking took me forever to fucking get the um, the window handle thing back on. But I got that back on, and yeah. And let me show you guys how it came out. So that is actually how it came out. Came out pretty clean, and it's okay if you 
get shit off, um, it just comes off with water. Or if you scratch at it, it comes off. But hell yeah, both of them look really good. Both sides look really, really good. So let me clean up and I'm gonna head back home and then I'll finish out the vlog and let you guys know what you need and about how much it'll cost you to do this if you want to do tours. So I'm gonna clean up real quick. I'll see you guys in a bit. Yo, what's up guys? Um, so you guys made it to the end of the vlog. Thank you so much for watching. And I hope that was really helpful. That was my first time doing it on the door panels. So yeah, um, let me recap of what I got. So I got the fabric. I got 20 inches of fabric and it worked for mine. You might need more depending on your car or you might need less, again, depending on your car. And I got that at Joann's for $4. And then the adhesive glue, I got at Walmart because at Joann's it was 20. But if you're looking to not spend that much and you don't want to spend that much, um, I went to Walmart and it was only actually 10 bucks. So yeah, hold on, let me roll up the window though loud ass diesel truck is coming but um yeah and then it just took me i say about three hours to finish everything tuck um i would use a card but if you want something a little bit stronger and thinner i would definitely recommend trying to find something because my old license kind of bent after a long time of like trying to scrunch it down in there but yeah um that's gonna conclude today's vlog i hope you guys enjoyed it and I will definitely see you guys next time. And we have some decals coming in. I ordered from Juan Pancun Cartel. So they should be coming in pretty soon. Um, his shop goes live. And if you haven't subscribed for his email list to get 15% off, um, go check out his Instagram page. I'll put it in the link below. And if you're in Utah and you need any banners or other small decals or like banner decals or any decals in general go hit up my boy adam at agility vinyl and apparel and he'll get you taken care of but thank you guys so much for watching and peace out